Officials from World Food Program visited the Indian town of Amritsar from where the thousands of tons of wheat is being sent to Afghanistan. They heaped praise on the Indian government saying the assistance being sent by India was of premium quality. Meanwhile, the Special Inspector General for Afghanistan has said that the humanitarian conditions were deteriorating rapidly in Afghanistan and the world needed to do more in order to prevent it from plunging into acute poverty. As India completed over 20% of its 50,000 metric ton target of wheat to be sent to Afghanistan, a team of officials from UN World Food Program visited a facility that procures, cleans and packages wheat for Afghanistan. The delegation from World Food Program visited the facility in northern Amritsar city and praised the work being performed at the facility. As part of humanitarian aid to the people of Afghanistan, India's wheat is being transported to the war-hit country via Pakistan's land route. As per different sources, the World Food Program officials were highly impressed the way wheat was being treated before being transported to Afghanistan, the country where the food insecurity has been rapidly climbing. There has been a partnership between WFP and Government of India and we have, the Government of India is sending uh, wheat from the people of India to the people of Afghanistan. The first tranche is over. We are now uh, sending the second tranche of 10,000 metric ton. India has so far sent 10,000 metric tons of wheat to Afghanistan. In total, India plans to send 50,000 tons of wheat to Afghanistan on an infrequently used land route through Pakistan in a bid to help the country facing poverty and hunger since the takeover by the Taliban last year. We're here to um, look at the operations and look at how the wheat's getting cleaned, how it's procured, cleaned and then how it's being shipped out. And it's a real pleasure to be here and uh, we're extremely impressed with the operation and all the hard work that's gone uh, into getting this wheat um, out to the people of Afghanistan as a, as a gift from the people of India. Meanwhile, the Special Inspector General for Afghanistan Reconstruction, Sigar, in its latest report said that since the takeover of the Islamic Emirate in August 2021, Humanitarian conditions have deteriorated with over 24.4 million people in need of humanitarian assistance in Afghanistan, an increase from 18.4 million in 2021. Sigar in a report to the US Congress said that 70% of the Afghans are unable to provide for their basic needs. This comes as the Food and Agriculture Organization, FAO, of the United Nations said that 53 world countries, including Afghanistan, face acute hunger. Afghanistan has been suffering from drought in recent years, made worse by climate change, with low crop yields raising fears of serious food shortages. The international community is grappling with how to help the country of some 40 million people without benefiting the Taliban. As per Sigar, the current humanitarian crisis in which 23 million or some 60% of the population are reliant on food aid is having a disproportionate impact on women and children.